mop tests included three different debris types, honey, soda, and mud. Mud posed no problem for the crosswave. Honey required several passes to make sure the floor was not sticky, but the floor was virtually spotless after passing over it several times. The only problem with cleaning soda was when it drifted into the corners. While there, the crosswave had trouble reaching it. The missile crosswave also has the ability to wash area rugs. Cleaning on area rugs was a bit of a mixed bag. During our test, we discovered that it's important to use the vacuum mode either on the crosswave or another standalone vacuum first to remove large chunks of debris, dirt, and other things on the surface of the carpet. During our test, we failed to do so, and as you can see on one side of our carpet, the mud and dirt was further embedded into the carpet, making a bigger mess. On the second side, we vacuumed first and then did the wet wash clean, which was able to then remove the finer debris without